Hey there, Panapon and Sauce Pans. I didn't expect to film this today, I'm gonna be real. But I had a thought. Both Kirby and God Hand are like, they're not gonna last a week. Like, whatever I'm doing right now, under a week this is gonna be over. I don't know how long MathFab 3 is, but then the next game after that is kind of you know, kind of easy to see. So, like, from here to a week from now, I think we're gonna have, like, one game waiting in the list, which is not a lot. In fact, it's a bit of a risky proposition. So, you know what? I think we're doing this. I think uh, now is the time to make some game decisions, and we all know what that means. Okay. All right, okay, so, hi, hey there everyone, Patapon, Saucepan, people who are just regular members of the audience who decide to watch, uh, for whatever reasons, hi, hey, how's it going? In this list, I have everyone who has enlisted to be part of the royal system. Reminder that it is opt-in, and then once you have opt-in, you are in. If you get picked up, get in contact with me and propose uh, three games of which I will play one of them. Uh, do be aware, however, that I don't know why I started that way. <laughs> yeah, uh, so like, you know, you got, I'm giving you like a week to reach me, even if for whatever reason you don't have your list ready. Uh, at least get in contact with me to tell me that you know, so I know you know. And, uh, let's just not lose any more time than that. Here we go! Video games exist! Maybe. That's why I want you to show me three, because if you just showed me one or two, I mean, like, that doesn't really mean anything. Zenistrad! Uh, it's you! It's you! You need to get games in my face! So this is really uh, interesting because Zenistrad is one of the earlier people who put on 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 like his name in the thing to be to be a royal. Like he is she I I don't know. You are one of the like toppest most you're like the, one of the first page submitters. Uh, that is exciting. So I hope the, <laughs> I hope you didn't mind the wait. I know it's been a little bit. But it is uh, done. It is you, Zenistad. Get in touch with me, please. Uh, give me some game names and maybe we'll do something about that. Alright, now the list is a little bit bigger because I added in everyone. Uh, everyone is all there, even the past winners. Uh, because we are now going to declare the court. I shall now roll five different individuals who have their name in the royal jumble and each of them is going to present to me one game and I will choose one of these. Sounds pretty normal. Well, I think, I mean, it's not abnormal. I mean, you don't know what's gonna happen with that. Yeah, like, it's kind of funny, like, I'm almost done with the first game that was chosen, which ended up being God Hand. I haven't played a second one I picked with that. Times are weird. Sebi! <laughs> Well, 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 well. Now there's a name I think a lot of people recognize. All right, first pick of the court, Sebi19. By the way, I should say that uh, I'm I'm putting down a new rule just to make things simpler for me. Uh, basically, if Zenistra, you know, if the royal doesn't show up, like there has been instances where the royal got one. I, they, they don't reach out to me. I try to reach out to them. I send them PM, send them an email. No response. Like, that's fine. That happens. Like, I'm not upset or anything. But it's a thing that can happen. And in the past, what happened is that I would um, roll a new royal. You know, naturally. What I'm going to do now, though, now that we have a court, if Zenistrad, for any reason, does not get in touch with me, which I doubt is going to happen. But, you know, it could happen. But if it doesn't happen... Then it would be the first court member that wasn't a royal before that would replace them instead of rolling a brand new person. So in this case, Sebi. Uh, like I said, I doubt this is going to happen very often, but it might. And so it's just good to kind of have, you know, have, have it out there, you know. Have the rule 
be very simple and explained in simple words or something that resembles that. Check it out. Nathan is bored! Now that's a long time name. Nathan is bored. Okay. Nathan is bored and hopefully also available to throw a game at me. I hope Nathan is happy about knowing they have one chance out of five to having their game pick, I guess, to be played by some idiot on the internet. I don't know. I don't know if that's a reason to get excited. I heard some people do get excited. Uh, getting excited is fun. <laughs> wow, today is just like all the old school peeps. Susie! Actual, non-ironic, leader of the advent, Red Mage Susie, also known as Susie by some people. Look at that, like, you cannot be more page one than Red Mage Susie right here. Like, uh, page one technically starts here, so, you know, because I've been putting court members on top because it's easier to just delete the space here. You know, you see, you see how I'm organizing this? It's very scientific. Well, here we go, the wheel is spinning, that is pretty wild. And I hope I don't trip, fall, and break my face open in the stairs. That would be tragic. Theodore Landman! Well, uh, you were once called over to make me play a game as a royal. Will you answer the call and give me a court option? I'm just gonna say it though, like uh, a reminder. A very... Uh, Theodore. A very important reminder. I'm going to hunt you down, for lack of a better word. Uh, if you are a member of... Um, you know, if you're the actual royal. If you're a court member though, like, I'll try and get in contact with you. Like, I will. But I'm not gonna go at the same level of extreme. So just, just so we know. And then we need a fifth. Five peeps and one game will be. I just keep repeating the, the whole concept behind the thing. It's very strange and very unnecessary. That's how we like things. Wow. Okay, all right, another like, this is like generation one of the Discord. So let's repeat ourselves. Zenistrad, you are the royal. Get in touch with me. Get three games to me. I'll play one eventually. Sevy19, Nathan is bored, Red Mage Susie, Theodore Landman, and Play Madness. Y'all give me one game of which I will choose one of the five that are proposed, ain't that great. And now of the, you know, so now we're kind of establishing this capsule, right? So, you know, the four part capsule, we've got a royal, we've got a court. There's the R zone, there's my own pick, which is gonna, is the one and fourth. Um, honestly, I'm going to extend the invitation to see if the winner of Map Ab 3 is interested. Uh, so like that space is reserved for that. So, now, it's been a little bit, but we're getting a poll, and the poll we're getting is going to be handcrafted by me. So I don't think it's necessary to do trailers, so I'll, I'll, I'd like for us to watch trailers together. Because uh, there are a lot of big reason I do that is for me to be aware of what's going on. Oh, however, I will put trailers or whatever um, in the Patreon thread. Because you're going to be voting. Remember to use the rank it vote. Remember to do it once and once only. If you try to repeat, the system will know and will delete uh, your votes. So don't do that. So here we go. So these are basically the five remaining games. So remember how I kind of have that, this list of games I want to play? Th these are it. These are five games I really want to be playing. I kind of want to be playing next. And you will be choosing one of these. So, first we got a Plumber for All Season, a Super Mario World ROM Hacks. You know, I've kind of been replaying that for a little bit, and it's been a lot of fun. Uh, so I played a contest, and I, I played a compilation. I think I'm due to play a ROM hack, which is, you know, a singular vision. You know, the work of an author. 
And also, a permafrost season isn't all that long, too. Like, it's a, it's a, I mean, I think it's like our hack size, right? Something like that, like 30 ish. I'm not sure. I can look. 41 exit. So, that is smaller than a little bit than our hack, though. I'm assuming it, okay, it says it right there 37 levels. So, very similar amount of level, actually, except, you know, like it's, it's like a singular work. Uh, and apparently, it is extremely good. You see, you got the style screen here. I'm gonna click on this one. Check out that rain effect. I know this is it. This is what you get. But you know, I'll put the link to this in the thread if you want to look through it. I just don't like to be spoiled. But yo, know, yeah, like this is something I'm in. Like this is like the next ROM hack. I kind of want to play, but like, when is the next time I'm gonna choose a ROM hack? I don't know. There's nothing wrong with voting for a ROM hack or something, something like that. You know, like, like, yeah, like, I have this big list of game, the bucket list. People have to realize something. There's over 600 games on this list. Even though it's my bucket list, it's bucket.txt, there is no way in hell that I'll be able to play every game on this list. Like, that's just the reality. That's why there's nothing wrong with having a game in a bucket in the Royal. There's nothing wrong with proposing a bucket game for your court game because the reality is I will not be able to play all the games in the list. In fact, I would bet that realistically speaking, considering the limits of time and space, I'm not going to be able to play most. So consider this. I do really want to play a plumber for all seasons. And so I ask for you all to give me the opportunity. I also give you ask you all for a person to play Sonic Colors. This would be the Wii version. This would be, you know, uh, re-stepping into the soft ATS bridge, you know, where I, there are still a lot of Sonic games I do want to play. It's just, it doesn't have his own, like, little speck in the world. But I still want to. And I feel like, you know, before I play a lot of Sonic games, Sonic Colors is kind of important to touch on because from what I understand... Uh, the Wisps are actually kind of a big deal and come back a lot going forward. Like, they're just part of the thing now. And so I think just playing Sonic Colors then is probably just smart. So, yeah. And also, I do want to actually play it. Star Wars Episode One Racer uh, from the abandoned before it could even begin. All the Star Wars, that was one of the games I was looking forward to. It was actually, it used to be on a bucket list until I removed it when I was uh, planning uh, all the everything. But now all the everything is not going to happen. Well, then the individual games are back. Uh, Star Wars One Racer is a game I owned on the N64. I love that game. I played it a lot. I have beaten it a few times probably. But that was all decades ago, plural. So, like, what do I remember? That is a good question because I would bet it's very little. It's a really cool game. It's a really fun game. I love racing games and I barely ever play racing games ever because I don't play outside of LPs anymore, right? And I just, I, it's, it tickles a specific thing that I really want to get tickled. So, that's why it's there. So, uh, if anyone watched the coming up necklace before I jumbled everything up grievously, uh, <laughs> in the old R zone, there was arcade double feature, and that would be it. Uh, technically speaking, it would not just be Strider, but Strider and Osman, which is an unofficial gameplay uh, sort of sequel. Like, the same director as Strider, but not in the same company or anything. But the gameplay is basically, like, a declination of Strider. They would be together, because, like, Strider playing it on its own is going to take, like, four days. And Osman 2 is kind of short, so both together would be, like, two weeks-ish, which I think is just an amount of time that makes a whole lot of sense. So, yeah, Strider-Osman combo... I want to play this. That is, that is, Strider is one of the single most important games for me. Um, whenever I would go to an arcade, when I was smaller, and you know, I went there a few occasions, there was a Strider cabinet, and I would always, 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 always make time for to at least give it a credit. And in these light, it's been, again actual plural decade since I last played and I I would love to 
I know I've said that for other games up on the list, but this one, though, like, from the heart, I, I would love to uh, re-experience. Osman I have a lot less experience with, but I it's, it's you know, fantastic. And the spectacle is amazing, and it's just so good. It is excellent early Capcom arcade platforming. Like, it's a type of game that just doesn't really exist anymore. It's absolutely fantastic. And fifth, last, but genuinely not least, with an extremely recent release date, We Heart Katamari Reroll. Remember at the end when I played Reroll and I was like, man, I hope they also reroll the sequel? I don't think they will, but boy, you know, I sure wish they would. Turns out they did. <laughs> like two years later, it, it's out there. It exists. It is on Steam. We Heart Katamari. You can reroll it. I I thought the reroll LP was pretty fun. Like, it's just such a different game. And the sequel goes hard on uh, on the gimmicks. I remember it being a lot of fun. I played reroll. Uh, I played Heart a lot more than I played uh, OG. Uh, but at the same time, I don't know. Like, I feel like what I remember is kind of foggy. So if you want a foggy LP, I feel like those are my best ones. <laughs> Well, the option is there. And so we have it. Plumber Fall Season, Sonic Colors, Episode 1 Racer, Strider slash Osman, and We Heart Katamari Reroll. These are the games we'll be voting on. So once again, check out the site. It's the ranking site. Uh, ranking site got an update where it will actually stop on the hour, not just on the day. So hopefully there won't be any confusion this time on when it actually stops. That's the hope. That's the dream. Patapon, Saucepan, thank you for listening in, getting a glimpse of what could be in the future. Zenistrad, get in touch with me as soon as you can. Five members of the court, same. Get in touch with me as soon as you can. And uh, we'll rumble something up. Good. <laughs> Finishing strong!